giving all of us quite the unrightful fright yesterday. Oh boy, do I have a story for you. But on, at the same time, while we're talking about that story, let's go ahead and pick out some swag. Pre-Comic-Con swag time. Let's go, let's go. Somebody had to go to the vet. Yeah, you. So we're not exactly sure what's going on, but keep somebody in your thoughts right now, okay? Yeah, you. So we believe Moo had a seizure, a micro seizure. She hasn't had one since it happened, thank goodness. So it could just be kind of like a human vagal response, but not exactly, you know, kind of one of those things. It happened once, let it never happen again. But we need to also acknowledge that somebody here is 18 going on 20 years old. <laughs> She'll be 19 this summer is what I mean by that statement. And... She gave us quite the fright. So she's okay f for now. She's home. She'll be all right. Just keep her in your thoughts, if you please. At the same time, right now, book one of the Myrna Annals, Bound by Fate and Blood, and book two, Bound by Oath and Heart, are on sale. Kind of. I'm waiting on Amazon to agree that it's okay to put book one on sale. As always, Rochelle's book, book two, processes immediately. Just like how she ends up being the proxy queen for Maren, Neftiri, Rochelle has to go first. So we're waiting for Neftiri to come out of her sequestered state. I don't think it's self-imposed exile. I think it's Amazon-imposed exile. <laughs> so they're going to be on sale. Mew. Oh, goodness. She's now trying to eat. <clears throat> Anywho. Oh. <sighs> I'm going to Four State Comic Con, Hagerstown, Maryland, the last weekend in April 2020. Four, 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 four. So I gotta go ahead and make sure I have enough swag and things. There's a couple of key items I need to purchase for it. I already went through and decided what copies of book one and two I need to order. That's already taken care of. They're actually sitting. Huh? This way, Jenna right next to the cat food there in that box. <laughs> so I know exactly how many I need to order. I need to order some banners. All of my banners are out of date from back when the series formerly known as the Arsinaway Forest Alliance, now known as the Myrna Annals. You know, so it has old marketing stuff on it. So I got to order new banners. I need to order some stuff in Amazon, one of the things I want to do while there, other than giving away some chances at Ream stories, they're also going to win a chance at a dice bag. So for those of you who don't know, my books are basically what happens when J.R. Ward, George R.R. R. Martin, and J.R.R. R. Tolkien sit down and play a game of something like D&D, &D, Pathfinder, or more appropriately, Vampire the Masquerade. <laughs> so imagine those three authors getting together and doing a tabletop RPG, basically. That's the Myrna Annals, in short. And hello. Since you're going to be back there anyway, might as well put you in the shot. Anyway, I bet she's going to start scratching the wall. Five.
Anywho, the um, there's a couple of other things I want to do. One of the things I want to do is get a huge old pouch o dice and do a guess how many dice is in here. So that will be the giveaway I do. So if you want to not only try to win the dice, but also copies of book one and two, that's the winning prize, then come on over to Four State Comic Con April the 27th and 28th, last weekend of the month, Hagerstown, Maryland. I'll be there. If you have a paperback copy, bring it with you. I'll sign it. If you want to purchase a paperback copy, I'll have some with me and I'll sign them. I'll also have some swag for those who do purchase there. And the two runners up to the giveaway will re will win a year to the top two tier, the top tier of my Reem stories. So it'll be definitely worth it. While I'm there, internet, hopefully, fingers crossed, behaving, I'm going to try and do a live stream of Sitting Down with Soul Writer Unscripted from the con. And I'm also going to do a Watch Me Make uh, Gorgor's character videos and book fives video while I'm there. So I'll be taking my computer stuff with me down the road to the con. Because that's what's funny. The convention is literally at the college that's like not even five miles away from where we live right now. So I told Cody it's kind of eerie <laughs> a little bit that we now live so close to my first con, but it's really cool. Because I can literally say, hey, Cody, go to the house and get, which will be very beneficial, I'm sure. I am trying to pack as much as I can, though. Keep that in mind. I'm going to be in their artist alley. I don't know what my booth number is yet. I'll probably find that out here soon. Come on and join me. Let's go pick out some swag. I got a transfer from my vlogging camera, my phone, over to Canva. Let's just do it this way. See you in a bit. High five. Woo! Alrighty, everybody, let's go ahead and get into Amazon proper. There are some really cool things I like to get as a small business owner through Amazon just because I can reliably get them there all the time. First and foremost, I actually want paper bags for this. I'm normally going to Amazon to check whatever pricing on their bulk mailing supplies are going to be versus other companies first, of course. I like to go here for my paper bags. I specifically want about a hundred of them. Do I think I'm going to? use that many in a weekend? I would love to. I don't think so. I want to plan ahead and have them because I plan on doing more in-person events throughout the summer months, of course. So with that being the case, let's go ahead here and do 100 purple. I just want like paper bags. I, I don't, I'm not a fan of plastic. Uh, I want yeast. This is what I'm looking for. Something along these lines. That's not bad for a hundred pack. Here's for $26, better reviews too. I think we'll go ahead and put those there. Can we find anything with handles, with handles for cheaper than 20? Whoop, there we go, 21. So I'm gonna swap those out. That's not bad. Those would be great for two books and a little bit of swag. That should be nice. I'm hoping, I'm hoping they'll be big enough. For my books so let's also go ahead just in case what was the size on those other ones see these are wider hmm no i do not want to get both these have fewer reviews and they look pretty petite let me look at a video up or another view up front well, they're saying it can hold four cans of soda stacked. That's not going to be wide enough. I'm glad I got that visual. Let me go ahead for the $26 ones then because they do look wider. And I'd rather have enough room just for the two books and everything else. Also, I'm going to look for... Tissue paper. 
Let's see. I'm okay with plain white tissue paper for $7, a hundred sheets. Hmm. Ooh, these are pretty. These blue ones. This actually, I don't mind these, that brown color. I didn't want to spend that much on them. I wanted to keep it under $10 for the tissue paper. That's not bad with the colored ones either. Ooh, okay, I'm stopping. <clears throat> Listening to my inner Nefteri, I am. Those are so pretty. And that gold me knowing gold and whatnot colors like I do. Why did that jump to 26? Gonna... Oh, that's right, I chose the 26. I need coffee before I do live stream sprints tonight. Yep, I need coffee. So at $9, might as well say, that's not bad. That's not bad. And that gold and that purple will look smashing together. Plus, I have uh, the autograph sticker is gold, so they'll go together, and that's just me. Um, what else do I need? Oh, small business freebies. I was told about this by a local business owner who owns like a physical shop, and it's super duper beneficial. So look at all these cool things that are just like little freebies that are inexpensive for you to toss in. I'm thinking about adding the, the eye masks as part of my Kickstarter or my book box, believe it or not. So I think that'll be fun. I did buy this kit here last year for my Kickstarter. I still have tons of stuff for it. It's such a good little clip pack of just general business cards that say, thank you for supporting my small business with some envelope ceiling stickers that stay the same. They're not branded, but they're really pretty. They're good little swag that I could like, you know, just sign my name on the back of right quick or seal something up with right quick. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and peep through at some ideas here. Elastic hair ties, that's an interesting idea. Of course, I'm gonna eventually get to stickers, eventually, and bookmarks. Stickers and bookmarks are going to be eventual things I check. I just like poking in here every now and again to under that specific search tab just to take a gander and, ooh, lip balm, 28 pack of lip balm, ooh. That's a good idea for the, um, gift, uh, for the book box, isn't it? That'd be an amazing job. Oh, Sarah Hardy's. Hearties! Oh, goodness. Okay, these are thank you cards that literally say you are the heart of my business. Oh, okay. I love that. I love that. That's adorbs. That, I, I might just have to put that in a new tab and share that with my fellow admin. That is adorables. Now, see, here's more like what I was thinking for this weekend. Something like this. These thank you mini lip balm gift packs. Like, I could see where somebody probably would also get this as a party favor or something of that nature. 20 bucks for 50 of them. You know, I'm looking at doing like the first 30 to 50 people get a little swag thing or like the first whatever number of people get a little swag thing. But I don't know if I need 50. Again, might lean to that with the Kickstarter. These are adorable. Little inspirational keychains as well. Same here. Let's see, let's see. Anything that I have to have for the weekend. I'm gonna ignore the 100 pack of pens because um, the pens there are going to kind of look like these. And I might end up keeping them instead of giving them away. So I better not, I better not follow into that temptation. See, look, good luck, enter to win. This is the kind of thing I was looking for. What I want to do, and I'll get into that here in a moment. Ooh, that will look good with the gold and the purple. Yup, we're gonna go ahead and put that in another tab. What I want to do is get a big bag of dice. 
and have them guess how many dice, but I want to do a couple of other giveaways, not just that one. And this, you know, enter to win type thing could be a good, like, I pull it after the con type of thing or toward the end of the con. See, these are so cool. Oh, your purchase made my day. I hope this package brightens yours. And did I? It's purple and gold, y'all. Mm, I think I have to as a requirement of being an admin for the Heart Breathing's writing community. I'm seeing you in sprints this weekend for a virtual writing retreat weekend, aren't I? Aren't I? I hope so. I hope so. So what then, and that's why I wanted the paper bags because I'm doing the swag bags, but I do not want that stuff. I don't want the crinkle paper stuff. I think that's going to be about all she wrote on this item. <gasps> this is so cool. So these are loyalty scratch cards. Oh, that's so cool. I could see where, like, see me at this con, like, every time, like, after I've done a couple years of cons, I could see where people could use these to track me down at different cons. That would be fun. That would be fun. And every time we'll get a picture and whatnot, please leave a review, share your photos. I think I need this sticker. I think I need that sticker. That's going in number, another tab for show, sure, for sure. All right. And then they have 200 affirmation cards. This is right up in my business, Sally. So these could be like freebie bookmarks and stuff like that. Because I have tassels I could attach to these to make them into bookmarks. That would be cool. That would be cool. That's a consideration. Because the next thing we're going to look at after we take it, oh, these stickers are so cool. Okay. They literally have, see, but I don't have a Twitter. Mm. Okay. What other designs? That's cool. The happy face, frowny face. Happy, leave us a review. Not happy. How can we make it right? Oh, and they have a heart version. I like the heart version. Sun and clouds. If you love it, let me know. And it has stars. I think that I think we have a winner. Or the heart. Hmm. Do I go with the stars? I kind of want to go with the stars because book reviews would be implied then, wouldn't they, everybody? I'm not going to take the subscribe and save at this time. I want to see what they are like in person. That's going in the bucket. <laughs> okay. We need to look at bookmarks because I have some bookmarks in there that are not related to the Kickstarter. They literally are Ian Neftiri and book one's cover on the front. And then on the back just takes you to a QR code and the written out version to the link in the QR code, which is jennathesoulwriter.com, my website. That's all, you know, it's just a quick, easy way to get them to go ahead and QR code over there. So I still want to look at bookmarks that are just like, you know, general swaggy bookmarks. We got those affirmation cards, which might, because soul care thing, right? That's on brand, which might be the ones I go with instead, because that's a, we'll see. Ooh, these are pretty. Cool night sky bookmarks. Those go in new tab bulk bookmarks how about we look up bulk bookmarks instead these are cool reading list bookmarks with a tassel on it people would go for that and here's ones that are like book trackers but they're book shelves hallelujah this is more what i was looking for and it has a coupon and it's on sale Freaking my lingua. Oh, you want me to log in for that, don't you? Don't you, Amazon? You're like, you're doing a lot of window shopping. Log in. I'll just add you to cart. I'll log in later. I'll be that person later. 
Oh, okay. So we, hmm, 699 versus 99. Okay. So now I'm in a conundrum because I have tassels, but for $3 more, I get it in a color with the reading list that I like more and it has tassels. Just going to look at it in another tab. How's that, Jenna? I'm going to have so many decisions to make. Oh my gosh. Cause I'm not going to tell you all which ones I ended up getting. <gasps> these floral ones are so pretty, so pretty. Okay, Rochelle, calm down. Calm down. You can tell I'm getting excited. And it's just pieces of pretty paper. So I, in the past, have done the colored in ones. I've done maps. I've done floral. I've done, I've done, I've done. The ones that I keep coming back to that I'm like, which ones do I like the most without even going up there are the affirmation ones and the reading list ones. I really do like the nautical ones though, because we spend a lot of time on the lusty strumpet in book one. We really, really do. And those bookshelf ones. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. See, there's the map ones. I, I've i done these. I don't want to go back to the map ones. I have some is what I'm trying to say. And Neftiri does work with tarot and things. And so does Frey in book three. It's actually something they talk about. That's only 12. These reading ones are really cool. These are really, really cool. And I, well, I think I just answered my own question. My Ream Stories is called the Myrna Private Collection at Amaranth's Library. I think I have to go with the reading list ones, don't I? Yes, you do, Jana. Now what do I go with? I, I have tassels aplenty, but... I kind of want both options here on the colors anyway and just mix and match the colors on the tassels. Yes, I would be hole punching them. And I might get these as my alternate then because I like to have one, like I like to have two designs in addition to my own. That's just me and give the customer a pick. So I think we're going to go add to cart. Add to cart add to cart now because the alternative i need to get into here i'm not spending over a hundred dollars on swag is i can't do hmm options 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 i'm definitely keeping with the wrapping paper and the purple bag I am likely keeping this business card and probably saving. I really want the you are the heart of my business one so badly. Kickstarter, Jenna. That could be for our Kickstarter crew and for me to save the link and send it to my fellow admin. That's awesome. I think I'm going to get the if you love it, leave me a review stickers to be what I use to seal up these, even though I have a ton. And that way I can leave the other ones as part of the Kickstarter too and give myself some options maybe, question mark. So I don't want to pass these up. But it becomes, do what do I use, which bookmarks? I have five bookmark choices. And I literally, of the five, I either can do the affirmation cards, the bookcases, the reading lists or the florals. Want to see which ones I go with? See you at four state comic con, April 27th and 28th, 2024 dice bags are the last thing we're going to look at together. Everybody dice bags, dice bags. So I want like, Oh, that's exactly what I want. Okay. I'm guilty of reusing the alcohol bag of non-brand naming by my naming as a dice bag. But the fact that people are literally selling 750 milliliters of dice <laughs> in 
in them is quite appropriate and hilarious. See, this is what I was looking at. Something I can spend like 10 to $15 and get a cool bag. That is so neat. New tab. <gasps> it's literally a D20, but it's over my budget. It's over my budget. It's over my budget. Ooh. Now I see two contenders here. Actually, I see three contenders. This one's kind of cool. It says capacity 200, but I don't know if it has dice in it or if it's just the bag. This is really cool because it could double as like a pen or pencil case or a makeup pouch or anything else you want to put in it pouch. Plus cats. Still on brand for me because Hello Lee and Harumi in book three and book five respectively. And then of course there's this pretty blue one that I can clearly see the dice. So that's some more options. Ooh, over 300. It's above my budget. So if you want a chance to not only see what dice and dice bag are available, but also come and do a chance to win the dice bag and count the dice that are in the dice bag to win it for State Comic Con, I think this is going to be a blast. I really do. I cannot wait to start my Comic-Con journey, and I hope to see you all there. Above all else, take care of yourself. You've been worth it from the beginning, and so is your voice. Bye. Thank you to our lovely Zomarine stories over at Amaranth's Library and the Myrna Private Collection. Whether you're a human ally, sunwalker, bard, song weaver, merry misfit, or more, thank you for subscribing to our ranks. We thank you for all you do to support us. Want to join our endeavors? head over to reamstories.com slash Myrna Private Collection. That's reamstories.com slash M-E-R-N-A Private Collection, all one word, where you can access all of my books and more long before they are available at retailers and vendors. Hope to hang out with you there soon.